hi, good morning. Kathy Johnson here. Joe Schmidt and I have been working on um, getting things together for voting this year for residents at East Castle. And of course, what we want most of all is for you to vote safely. We want to make sure that everybody who wants to vote does vote, but the best way to do it, absentee ballot. Um, this will, your ballot will count as much as anybody else's, but you're going to be doing it safely. If you insist on voting in person, the next best option would be early voting, and the East Library will be the site of early voting for two weeks prior to November 3rd. But the best thing of all, absentee. And we know that many of you have already signed up for your absentee ballot. Now I know you've probably seen in the news that absentee ballots may be delayed a bit. However, we're still expecting them sometime in September, I would think latest, earlier October. So in the meantime, what I would encourage you to do is go down your computer and look at vote411.org. This is a website run by the League of Women Voters. It has exactly what's going to be on your ballot and information about the candidates. So if the candidate responds to a survey that has been sent out or a questionnaire that has been sent out by the League of Women Voters, those answers will be on that website so that no more can you say, oh, I don't know who to vote for. You'll know by checking out vote411.org. Once the ballots start coming to us, the absentee ballots, we will start setting up sessions um, in the meditation room every Wednesday from 9 to 11 in the morning, 1 to 3 in the afternoon, where we will make sure that the ballot is all set to go and we'll get them to the elections office. So we'd like you to do the following. As soon as you get your ballot, complete it and make sure that you use black ink. And remember, no big blobs, no X's, mark the little, the little areas. So complete the ballot, but don't seal it. The Elections Commission is also wanting to be safe, so they don't want people licking the envelopes. So do not seal the envelope, and please don't mail it. We want to make sure that your ballot gets to the elections office. So what we will do is when you bring your ballot down to the meditation room on the first Wednesday after you complete your ballot, 9 to 11, 1 to 3, meditation room, we will witness it. We will make sure that you have signed it. We will seal it using glue sticks so that we're all safe. We will collect all of the ballots and Gary Aubrey is going to deliver them to the elections office so that you, we will make sure that your ballot gets straight to the elections office on time, safely and securely. If by some chance you have not signed up for an absentee ballot, please do so as soon as possible. You can always give Joe Schmidt, Kathy Johnson a call and we can help you through that process if you need that assistance. So, good luck with uh, voting this year. We're here to help you. Take care.